I remember training with my father in the years after the Rat Plague. Someday, he said, our enemies will come for you. I'm not gonna lie. She sounds really cute. So, that's right. You know the deal. This is Dishonored 2. I had so much fun playing the first game that I just had to play the sequel. And you know what? I hope you guys have been noticing a pattern here. Lately, I'm all about the sequels, so I hope you enjoy. Oh. So I the decided to smells of never change much. To do the tutorial. This is my city. So we're gonna do a couple of practice runs here just to get reacquainted with this game. Press L3 while moving what to sprint. Does father have in store for me today? We oh right, Majesty. Let's see what you can do. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me and hit the notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. Ew, I have to crouch in this nasty water? Ew. Oh. Okay, so I got sprint. Psych! Woo! I can't believe I had a slide. Vault the obstacle, then slide under. Sprint, vault, obstacle, so this. Whee! Yes. Wow. Thank goodness I was skilled enough to do that. Just imagine if I was squished. What's that next? would be so awkward. Is there anything in here for me? No, okay. Nothing here. All right, all the way up. What do I do? Climb? Swim? Use L to move in the water. Press L3 to swim faster. Uh, awkward. Thank you. And perfect. <gasps> Whew, I know, right? I'm sorry. It took me a minute to figure it out. But I made it through safely. Oh, I remember doing this just like in part one. Press square near a chain to start climbing. While climbing, use L to move up and down. Ooh, this is so high. Okay. If only I could spend every day running and jumping. Same here. Same here. <sighs> but then again, I'm no, too short to jump, me. so... Ooh, okay. I got this. I got this. You ready? And go. Woo! Am I dead? Okay, that was a fail, and I know I died. That was a long way to go. Come to me. Okay, damn. Hold on. Woo! I can reach the end. You've learned well. Let's see how quiet you are, young lady. Okay. Press circle to toggle stealth mode. Crouching down and walking silently. Your visibility in stealth mode is greatly reduced. Stay behind cover and out of sight to avoid being detected. Okay. Got it. I got choke carbo. Hey yo, this well, is gonna be the value of quiet feet. This is gonna be really interesting because I really doubt I can do that. I mean it's corvo we're talking about. Look at him. How am I supposed to make sure I choke the man? Because in all reality, he has senses. Am I really able to choke him? I really gotta see this. R1? Am I really choking you? Carvo. Okay, cool. 
That's my girl. Aw, thanks, Dad. Don't let me hear you or see you. So I have to do this, right? Okay. So I gotta do it again? Okay, so I gotta sneak up and oh um... Alright, I gotta steal the key, so what, do this? And then to stay out of sight. Yeah, yeah. See anything at all. Cool. I'm really good at choking In people. The words of Corvo Atano, hidden like a secret, quiet as the sunset. Okay, this is cute. I like this tutorial. Now I gotta do the crossbow, right? Wow, I am so excited. Yeah, I remember, especially from um, from part one. Uh, I really can't shoot, huh? Okay, I got it. I got it. I got this. Wow, that's so cool. Got it. Now what? Ooh, this? I gotta hit this? How am I supposed to... Let me see something here. I see the rats, of course. Huh, so I have to get that. Okay. Let me see if I could. So we're talking... Oh, wow. Amazing. Thanks, Dad. I feel so happy. My daddy issues has suddenly been cured. Alright, let's see. Let's see what's going on through this door. Time for some more weapons and combat training. Okay. Let's beat each other up, shall we? What? No! No! What? Chill! Chill! Okay, Come so on. this... Okay, fine. Yes. Okay. Alright. You hit hard. That's my daughter. Aw, thanks, Dad. My I love this. A sword at you. Block. Got you. I love this, uh, daughter-father time. Woo! Okay. Good. Okay. You need to- Woo! Chill. Well you need done. to chill. You need to Watch chill. Woo! Blade. Very good. You've got a natural instinct for fighting. I mean, look who's my dad, of course. Block right, you'll throw an enemy off balance. Oh, I, I got stabbed. Stop, bro. Woo! Okay, so like that, right? Quick. Yeah? Okay, one more. Smart move. Chill. Woo! Woo! Damn, I got stabbed again. Dad, come on, beat. Woo! That'd stop even the most black-hearted killer. Thanks. You can choke an enemy out even in combat. Okay, now you got to teach me that. So when an enemy is off balance, grab them. Damn, okay. Damn, okay, hold on. Do it. Shit. Woo! Oh my gosh. Come on, do it! Do it! Got you. There you go. Wow, now I know how to do this move. Thanks, Dad. While they're off balance, deliver a fatal blow. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, dang! I got stabbed. a sword at you. Block. I'm trying. This is hard. Okay. Woo! And then this. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. Come on. Ooh, I got stab. Ah, oh, I got stabbed again. Right here. Is that good? Oh, look at my dad. He's so proud of me. Thanks, Dad. Feel better knowing you can take care of yourself. When trouble does finally come, you're ready to fight. And I got you by my side. Why do we celebrate the anniversary of an assassination? Fifteen years ago, in the middle of a plague that nearly destroyed Dunwall, a paid killer assaulted the palace where I was born and stabbed my mother in the heart. Yes, I remember like it was a couple months ago. In the aftermath, the men who sent the assassin tried to use me as a pawn in a game of power. They would have succeeded. But my father, 
Corvo Atano hunted them down and cut their conspiracy to pieces. I remember every single kill, too. All these years later, am I the ruler my mother wanted me to be? Yes. Yes, she does. Now, we face a new crisis. A monster the papers are calling the crown killer has been picking off my enemies and dressing it up like my father and I are responsible. Wow, that's crazy. Who's doing this? I don't know whether to get on a ship and sail to the opposite side of the world. Or to have everyone around me executed. Yeah, that's some heavy choices right there. Gentlemen. Lady. Watch your step, Majesty. Okay. I'm not looking forward to all the ceremony today. Your signet ring. There. You're ready. Thank you, Thank Alexa. you. Open the doors. Not gonna lie, Lexi's kinda cute too. All hail her Imperial Majesty, Emily Caldwin. Loyal subjects, we're going through a difficult time, but today we honor my mother, the late Jessamine Caldwin. May her memory survive through the ages. Emily. You look tired, Father. Every year, I think the anniversary of Jessamine's death will be easier, but it never is. I wish Mother was still the Empress. I don't think I'm very good at this. You're still learning. Don't worry about the rabble-rousers, and we'll catch the Crown Killer, eventually. People are saying it's you, that these assassinations are a misguided effort to protect me. No, someone's trying to make us look guilty by targeting your enemies. I wish I could just run away from all this. Sometimes you do. You think I don't know about your nights out on the rooftops? What? Courage. The ceremony will be over soon. Royal protector and father. I should have passed a law against that combination of titles years ago. Wow, look at my mom. That's my throne? I hope it's comfy. It doesn't really look like it. Your Majesty, before we begin the day's observances, we have an unexpected visitor, the Duke of Sirkonos. Ramsay says the Duke is bringing special gifts. That's I hope. I hope it's not killer gifts. What is this? Mechanical soldiers. Amazing. What is this, Ramsay? I didn't authorize those things. What is Your that? Imperial Majesty and Royal Protector Corvo Atano, a native of our homeland. Sirkonus offers condolences on this sorrowful day and gifts to remind you of our nation, the rising star on the southern horizon. We thank you, Your Grace. Save your thanks. For now, I give you the greatest gift of all, family. I present the family. lost sister of Jessamine Caldwin. The lost your sister? Empress. Delilah Caldwin. Impossible. What? My mother had a sister? My dearest niece, hello. It's not true. My father was Emperor Yuhorn Jacob Caldwin, and Jessamine was my younger sister. So where have the you time been? Of her death, I wasn't ready to make myself known to you, and I was forced to leave Dunwall. But now I'm home. If you really what? are my mother's sister, you're welcome to stay as long as you like. Little Sparrow. Blackened by bad memories, I'm here to relieve you of your crown. What? My father's promise, whispered in secret so many years ago, is now fulfilled. Watch your tongue. Emily Caldwin is the daughter of Empress Jessamine Caldwin. Royal protector. How naive to think you could get away with these murders. Living in my palace has protected you. But your palace? Bad. Your Being palace? Me, all of you. Your rightful Empress has returned. All hail the Empress Delilah. First of her name. As if. Caldwin and her father for the crown killer. Are you kidding me? What? No! That's my dad! What? You were in on this too? Disgusting. my heart. 
What? She's taking away his powers? Dad, are you okay? Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, okay. So this is interesting. So at this moment in time, I have a choice. Play as Corvo, legendary royal protector to the Empress and figure of infamy from the time of the Rat Plague, or play as Emily, ruler of the Empire of the Isles, trained in stealth and combat by her father, Corvo. The thing is, in part one, I played as Corvo. I went through all the missions, the trials, the tribulations as this man, and I enjoyed it a lot. But I always wanted to know what it's like to play as Emily. I mean, yeah, part one, she was a little kid, so I couldn't really play her. But now that she's grown, I have the opportunity to choose her and see how I can experience this game through her eyes. Or should I pick as Corvo because, you know, nostalgia and number two, why not just, you know, play just like old times again? What shall I choose? So many choices. Emily. Yep, let's play as Emily. Why not? I need a fresh new take on the whole Dishonored series. Cast you in cold marble. No! What? No! That's my dad, you asshole! Sweet girl. Over time, you will come to love me. As if. Perhaps someday you'll see me as the mother you lost. I can't but wait to punch you in the face. Be kept out of trouble. I'll lock Lady Emily in her chambers, and I'll bring her to cold <gasps> prison until her trial. And you kicked me in the face? My father lost it all when I was a boy, so now I wear this uniform, and I send 20-year-olds out to patrol the Rose Gardens instead of drinking with the men from the shooting club. Okay, thank you for your backstory. Why should I care? I heard shouting. Lady Emily is... What no! 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 Oh no! <laughs> Not the redhead! <laughs> Not the redhead! Fancy weapon. What kind of sword folds in half? <laughs> Not the redhead! Not the sexy, cute redhead guard! Oh no, this game's brutal! Brutal! There's a legend in the Tower Guard about the Empress's last resort, a safe room inside your chambers holding enough gold to buy a good-sized island. Okay. They say that this ring is one of the only two keys to exist. I should... I should kill you, man. You took away my dad? What, what happened? Alexei. The throne room. Father. First, my dad, and now you took Nothing away the redhead? I need to get out of here. Should I? Hey, yo, should I really jump? I'm scared. I looked at that skyline. It feels like everything just changed. The man's moving up in the world. He's old. These blood. bastards are working with Ramsey and the Duke of Sopranos. <gasps> Look at all the blood! Look at all the blood! The are gonna be back and the thing is, I can't really... Of course, the door is unlocked. Let me let me eat some fruit to raise up my health, you know? Because in times of crisis, you gotta stuff your face. I used to hide frogs in this old grandfather clock to drive the housekeepers mad. Wait, I thought what's life this? Was complicated back then. Empress, we face yet another murder, and I cannot remain silent on this matter. Strange, is it not, that all the victims have openly opposed you? If not strange, then oh, so very convenient. Is there anything you wish to tell me, Majesty? How can I be an advisor if you don't include me in these most sensitive of endeavors? I feel I must be the only person in Dunwell who doesn't know the truth about the crown killer. Don't leave me out in the cold. I remain your trusted servant and advisor, Leonora Helm's water. That's cute. That is so cute. Should I Gotta just do another spin? spin. Pick a place to hide for a while. 
Yeah, let's just... need time to think. Let's spin. I say we can hide in the middle of the ocean. That's it. Okay, but seriously, though, what am I supposed to do? At this point, I guess it's option... It's... I think... I think my only option is to go out the window. Okay, bye. Let's go. Come on. Go out the window. There you go. And we are out the window. We. Delilah is some sort of witch. How is this possible? Oh my god, the redhead to life? You're... Where's the royal protector? It's okay, it's okay. Underway. My father is... He's imprisoned, for lack of a better word. You've got to get out of the tower, through your safe room. There was a captain earlier today, down at the docks. Okay. Looking for the royal protector. Find her. Get okay. out of Dunwall. Will do. No! Alexi. No! I'm sorry. No! <laughs> Not the redhead! No! Captain Mayhew, you don't know me, but you've got to tell the royal protector that I have urgent need of his time. I'm carrying a message that has to be delivered face to face. Tell him I'm working with Anton Sokolov, an old friend. All the boats are being sent away from the docks, but I'll delay as long as I can. Tell Lord Corvo to find me there. My ship is called the Dreadful Whale. What kind of a name for a ship is that, Megan? But I'm not gonna lie. The redhead. No. Not the redhead. Damn. Can I have one cute woman be alive in this game? I know, my mommy issues are, like, really apparent, but I really don't care. I need my signet ring. Damn, my ring. You're right. The ring is right there, too. Alright. Can I sneak? How, how do I sneak? Interesting. Alright, lock, all that good stuff. Alright, let me see. Cool. Nice. Okay. Wait, what did I do? Oh, okay. So by holding triangle and moving L, you can lean around corners. Thank you. That's all I need. Oh, that's cute. So cute. Is there anything I can pick over here? Yes. No, I don't need any more food, I guess. Whatever. Okay, nothing for me to pick. What's this? Emily, I know times are hard. You're the ruler of four nations. And I won't pretend to understand the pressure you're under. Only you and your mother before you could know what that's like. Whoever's killing off your enemies is doing so for calculated effect. Undermining us. And I do know what it's like to be blamed for murders you didn't commit. Oh, but Dad. Me, we'll find this crown killer, and they'll pay. Tomorrow is the anniversary of her death. A sad day, for sure. But I want you to remember all that's happened over the last 15 years. You've held on to the throne, and you've done what you thought was right for the people of the Empire. You drained the flooded district, kept the gangs in check, and yesterday we launched a magnificent ship bearing Jessamine's name. You're becoming the sovereign your mother wanted you to be, and I'm proud wow. of you. Oh, Dad! <laughs> oh my God. This game is giving me such daddy issues. Or better yet, healing my daddy issues, you know? What's in here? Is there any goods in here for me to take? Okay, nothing here. Huh, okay, so definitely, definitely some opportunity to make coins here. Nothing wrong with that. Oh my gosh, Alexi, the cutest, the cutest bodyguard I've ever had. 
Ah, oh, tell me, I don't need a, a tutorial on this one. Uh, how about this one? Shh, shut up. You lucky I don't kill you. What you got? A key? Thank you. That's all I need. The throne room. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Look at all the dead people here. Disgusting. Disgusting. All the people that were invited to to honor the passing of my mom is dead. I'll take that. Thank you. Gotta have some money, you know. Wow, even the maid. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's me. Excuse me. Woo! Come here. Thank you. Goodbye. Are we done here? Traitors. Are we done here? Wow, my first kill. My first kill in this game. And you know what? I'm in the mood for a pear and an apple and some grapes. Thank you. So good. Um, 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 um. Delicioso. Let's go. What's in here? Some spoons, forks? Nah, I'm good. Wow, the maid. I am so sorry. I am so sorry you got killed. You did not deserve that. What's in this corner? Nothing. A hideaway. Alright, I'm ready. I'm ready to kick some ass. Strong room blocked off. We should have the time we need. Just stay here and stall anyone who comes by. I'll be back when I have searched the royal chambers. Assuming I don't accidentally lock myself in this damn safe room. We'll cover for you if anyone from the Duke's party returns. Huh. This is exciting. Everything's what? changing. Sick! Yes. The natural order is reasserting itself. The Ramses once hosted the king and queen of Morley. Did you know that? I spent my childhood playing with the buntings and the boils. And the cream oh, no, society. the boils. And very soon you'll be back at the top, Captain. I remember the boils. That was a very interesting episode. Ramsey's trying to figure fell out from the aristocracy, and apparently the man holds a grudge. How it's my fault? That's beyond me. But one way or another, Ramsey is too dangerous to be left in play. Oh, something stinks around here. I'm the Boyle sisters. Out. Remember on Dishonored One, where we had to figure out which sister to kill? Laughable. Oh. oh, yeah, he's so getting killed. I really don't care. Come here. Let's kill him. Hi. Ooh. Hey, yo, you did you see that? that? She she spun his head around. That is sick. Again. I'm happy. Let's go, Emily. All right, so now we got to go to the safe room. And honestly, I was not going to knock him out. He deserves to die for being the little pig that he is. Kidnapping my father and killing that one guard that I had a fat ass crush on. Oh my god, Alexi, I'm sorry. All right, let's go. I got to keep going. Anton Sokolov made this lock. Alright, I'm out of here. I am out of here. There's no reason for me to stay. Oh, wait. Let me let me get the coins. Let me get the coins. Thank you. Thank you. I love getting I money. So many nights in here after the rat plague. And now we're gonna be here one last time. Ooh, bullets? What's this? Nah, I'm good. Nothing interesting. Whatever. I'll oh, take that. This. Yeah, I know. Bone charms. Huh. Interesting. Crown killer strikes again. Done well, citizens. Express shock and fear as yet another outspoken critic of Empress Emily Caldwin has met with a violent demise. The latest victim is none other than Ichabod Boyle, notable entrepreneur and supporter of the arts. 
Boyle recently wrote an opinion piece harshly criticizing the Empress for what he called her slips hot style of governance and her wonderful neglect of duties. Authorities are convinced the crown killer is the culprit, given the gruesome details left at the crime scene. As Her Majesty's most outspoken adversaries, sorry, adversaries fall one by one to this notorious assassin, we boldly ask, is it now the duty of the royal protector to murder all who dare to criticize the throne? The crown killer must be connected to all this, with the Duke and Delilah. Oh yeah, you know, I, I, I gotta get things. my gun. Ooh, that's a better gun than part one. Let's go. And is that a scope for my weapon? Oh, this is so dope. I am so impressed. All right, all right, let me see, let me see. The What's in here? Want to help against Delilah, even if I had a way to carry it all out of here. Ooh, that is some thick, dummy thick gold. Wow. Okay. Well, I took the little bar since that's the only thing I can carry. Okay, that's cool. My little drawings. Oh, that's so cute. I love this. Ooh, trauma. Yay. Let's draw trauma. Is there anything else I can take here? No? No. Wait. Aww. That's so cute. I'll read that later. Yeah, you know, I had to eat. Leave me alone. Wait. What's this? Emily, I didn't want to wake you this morning, but you'll forgive me since we must have said goodbye a hundred times yesterday night. And the only chance I get to see you with your hair all, whichever way is while you're asleep. As soon as the sun rises, you'll put on your empress face. It makes me happy that I know your real face, the one that laughs at our silly rhymes. I don't want to go back to Morley, but I'm needed there. It'll be four months before we each see each other again. I'll miss you. And yes, I'll bring you some white leaf tobacco for your hookah. Lord Kovo, if you're reading this letter as per your royal protector functions, know that I am joking and perfectly aware that the white leaf tobacco is forbidden in Gristol. Take care, my darling Emily. Don't don't go falling from a root off. I love you. Why, man? Is that your boyfriend, Emily? That's so cute. Old Samuel made this. I'm glad he didn't live to see me driven out of Dunwall Tower. Oh, Sam! I forgot about Sam! Okay, let's go. I miss that guy. Yes, let's go. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.